everybody! I am making a little bit different of a video today for you all, but I wanted to talk about kind of my situation right now, give a little uh, life update, I guess, and um, kind of make a vlog type video. I've, I've done a couple of these in the past and I really loved them and you guys seem to love them too. So here's another one. Um, so this is my dog mud, <laughs> but I, I just graduated high school and I'm heading off to college, to go to college at Brigham Young University, Idaho um, uh, this fall. And as most of you who watch my channel already know, I'm a singer and I play the piano and I make singing videos all the time. Uh, just from my house and and lots of other places, but mostly I just make videos from my house and um, as I have been preparing to leave to go to school I've been kind of wondering how I was gonna make YouTube uh, work while I was there because my family lives here in Arizona and all my recording equipment is here and my piano and everything but it's it's gonna be kind of hard to transport my uh, <laughs> the pianos that I have to my dorm in Idaho from here in Arizona so I was kind of um, basically just planning on going to school seeing what my options were there and then figuring it out <laughs> and maybe not doing uh, videos maybe not do videos for a couple weeks um, until I got it all figured out. But then, out of the blue, by some miracle, this awesome company, Donner, uh, messaged me and just, you know, they said, we are a musical instrument company and we'd love to do a partnership with you. Do you want to take a look at some of our products and see which ones you like? And I was like, oh my gosh, this just solved all my problems. So I took a look at a few of their pianos and I chose, let me set it down here so everyone can see. This is the piano that I chose, and I'm going to do a little, oh, too tall. This is the piano, mud. <laughs> this is the piano that I chose, and I'm going to do a little unboxing video. It's the DEP20 digital piano. saying if there are any problems with the piano that I don't like or anything then contact them and I'll take care of it. Okay. Uh, excuse me, Mud. Hold on, I'm gonna put Mud outside. <sighs> okay, I'm back. So, first things first. A music stand. I'm pretty sure this is, yeah. Pretty sure this is gonna attach to the piano right here so I can have a stand. That's awesome. Now here is me just trying to figure out how to get it out of the box <laughs> without damaging it at all. And it surprisingly wasn't actually that heavy even though it looks heavy and I look weak lifting it up. But oh, it's not that heavy. Oh, so pretty. keys. Well, this has a lot of features. Continue with the unboxing. Okay, this is sweet. Okay, so here is the pedal. That's super nice. And you I believe you just plug it in on Oh, right here. So the sustain pedal goes plugs in right here. Like so. 
so like that. <laughs> oh, I'm breaking it already. And there's the switch on it. I'm not sure what that is for yet, but I will figure it out. Traditionally, in my videos, in my acoustic piano, I just use the sound that emits from the piano. I pick it up with my microphone, the same one I use for my voice, nothing fancy. But for this, I believe, yeah, there's a place on the back here where I can plug it into my computer and use it on GarageBand. So nothing's gonna come out. These speakers is gonna go straight into my computer and I can control the volume of the piano. I know people, it's so hard because people complain to me all the time, like turn the piano down, turn the piano up, but it's hard when it's just the piano <laughs> uh, making this noise. So it's gonna be super nice to control that from my computer. So this is the power adapter, I believe. Okay, and it has this little, take off this I guess to oh if it I think this is the outlet for a different country right so I can plug it in anywhere does it say I'm not really sure but it has this feature which is cool so you can take off maybe it's to protect it you can take off the plug Maybe someone knows why it does that. You can tell me. Um, and then you just plug this into the wall and then the power goes right here. Power cord plugs in right here. Um, all the sand just fits on. That's so nice. You can also get the Donner Digital Piano DEP20 with a stand. Not, it makes it non-portable. So like, if you want a digital piano like this, you could, it could come with legs on it. Um, I specifically chose one without the legs, and then I just have a regular, regular piano stand that I can put it on. Um, so that I could transport it to college and keep it in my dorm and if I need to put it away it can be um, stored in another place um, but I'm so excited to try this out I'm gonna plug it in and test it out alrighty okay I got it all set up on my stand I got my music stand I'm just gonna put it on to show you it's so simple, I love it. You can just click it right on. And then if I don't need it and I want uh, to film a video like frontwards to see my uh, hands play, then that's super easy to just attach it to, which I love. Um, let's turn it on and test it out. So here's the power button right here. I'm just gonna hold it down for a second and it'll turn on. So if you press down the pedal and you play a note, as long as the pedal's down, it'll keep playing until you let go and it stays off. 
And then if you switch this pet, the switch on the side, then it is the opposite. So I'm not pressing the pedal, but I'm pressing the note and lifting up and it's still playing. But then as soon as I tap this, and it stops. And if I switch it, if I hold it down, this way where you have to hold it down and press the note um, and your pedal controls when it starts and stops opposed to the other way this is the traditional way of uh, of an acoustic piano so that's what I'm used to that's really cool that it has both settings though for anyone who is used to the other way um, or maybe you just want it you know to play like that all the time so myself into when I started but there are 199 uh, drum rhythm settings you just press this rhythm button and then you can just click through all of them that's amazing I can also make my own drum beat on here <laughs> if I ever wanted to create my own rhythm on here I could actually record it by pressing this record button right here and then I can add my own track on here so if I'm ever playing and I want a specific drum beat I can just press um, I can set it up so I can have that track ready on here when I start a song and then just press start and my drum beat will play along with me that is so cool okay this is a full 88 key digital piano, uh, full size, full weighted. That was my 
one request. Let us stay So I literally just kept playing with this piano and all of its features until my camera died and forgot to film an ending. So here's your ending. You can get a discount uh, for 20% off using the code EVI20. And I love this piano and I love you. Goodbye.